Hey you! Come here! I want to show you something. Welcome to my world. Pretty simple, isn't it? Nothing much to do, no one to talk to, no distractions for the wandering mind. I want you to clear your mind for a moment and come on a bit of a journey with me. Think outside the box, as they say. Are you ready? Good. Wake up. Time to get up. So what did you do this morning? When you got up, that is. Did you get up straight away? Did you stay in bed till the last possible moment? What did you have for breakfast? Cereal, juice, coffee, eggs, toast, pancakes. I hope you filled up for a big day. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Let's think outside the box. I want to introduce you to a friend of mine. Her name is Chim Weiwei. She lives with her grandmother in Tanzania. Her mother and father died of AIDS a couple of years ago. It's morning now and Chim Weiwei has to make the one hour journey to school. Do you know what she had for breakfast? Nothing. She has to carry on her day on an empty stomach. Yeah, I look at myself as different from the others. I feel like I'm different because my friends put on a school uniform, but I don't have a uniform. This is because my friends have their parents who can buy them a uniform, but I don't have parents. Hunger. When it hits you, it's comforting to know you're probably no more than five minutes away from some cheap takeaway. The chance to do something real doesn't come along every day. Something that matters something that can actually make a difference. The 40 hour famine is a great chance to do something real that'll help kids like Chim Weiwei. Come on, do something real.